Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the second, but you know, the timing is fluid. It could happen in any at any time. I got my something about Mary hair going on today. Anyhow, um, so what do we have for a message? What do we have for a message for whenever it resonates? Oh, this four of cups, discontent, thinking. Somebody is thinking about an opportunity. They're thinking about an opportunity for love. It's right there. It's a huge opportunity for love. They're thinking about it a lot. They see it. They, they're really, really contemplating. There's a huge opportunity for love right there. It is. I mean, it is. It's a that's a cup of love. That's a new start in love. And there's an opportunity for, you know, emotional fulfillment right there. It's right there. This person sees it. They see it very clearly. But there's also, you know, probably another person in the mix with that three of cups down there. There could be a third party situation. Empress reversed. Now the Empress reversed is somebody that's not very motherly, not very tender, not very caring, um, self-absorbed, doesn't keep, take very good care of her children, doesn't take very good care of the house, probably poor housekeeping. This person may be very clingy, very selfish, very mean-spirited, um, not very nurturing. You know, the empress in reverse is an empress wannabe, somebody that wants to be an empress, but they don't, they don't put in the effort to be one, or they, they just don't, maybe they just aren't mature enough, or they're just not interested. Queen of Coins in the upright after that Empress in reversed. So we, this is somebody that is stable, that is solid, that is hardworking, that is very capable. This is a homemaker. This is a homemaker. Y'all got to see my, my shitty old thumb. Um, that's why I haven't got my nails. But anyhow, the Queen of Pentacles is... Uh, is somebody that is very hardworking, very loyal, very, this is a mother, this is very motherly, this is the Empress energy is in this Queen of Pentacles, um, very solid, she has a golden opportunity, she is secure, uh, male or female in this case, um, the feminine one before that, that's probably a female, we have a man that is thinking about well, he looks like he has two people here, and I do see the third, the third party situation. There's one person that is not very nurturing, that is not very caring, that is not very loving, that doesn't have anything really to offer. This person is too, probably too materialistic, you know, just not very loving. And then there's another option that is very stable, very solid, very secure. Um, this is a business woman or a businessman. Uh, this is somebody that in the future that is, uh, that's who they're thinking about. Somebody that has a lot to offer. I mean, the queen of pentacles, queen of value, right? Somebody that has something of value to offer. So we definitely have, it looks like it's a man to me. That, but it doesn't have to be this thinking about an opportunity for love. They're thinking about it quite a bit. There is another person in the mix. It could be a mother, could be a wife, could be a girlfriend, um, could be an ex. There is somebody here that is hindering them from grabbing that opportunity. I, I can't stop with the faces. I'm sorry. Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups right after the Queen of Pentacles. So the Ten of Cups is a comfortable home. It's it's happily ever after. It's a spiritual blessing. This is comfort. This is love. This is extreme happiness. Okay, so there is an opportunity for happiness here, for comfort, for 
something permanent. This is a spiritual blessing in the future, but it's a completion. It's also a completion. So we have a Queen of Pentacles that is very, well, this is stable, that offers comfort. Okay, this is somebody that is abundant and that's a golden opportunity for comfort and happiness. Look at that comfortable home. It's very, very comfortable. It's, 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 well, easy. Death reversed right underneath the queen or the empress reversed. Death reverse. This whole knot is getting old. Okay, this ending is going to happen. It is going to happen. Um, there's been a delay. There's stagnation. This is, it's just about over anyway. Um, the death is holding on, is getting old in reverse. It's like it's, it's time. It's time to face your fear. Somebody is held back by fear. They are held back by fear. And it could be control as well. A new life is desirable. We have somebody here that wants to, um, wants the comfortable home, wants the happiness. They see the opportunity for love, but they're held back by fear. Judgment reverse. Now, judgment reverse is a poor judgment call, a need to move on from a bad choice. Somebody is struggling to move on from a bad choice that they made, a karmic contract. Um, they're afraid they won't be accepted. They are afraid that they will not be accepted if they end it with the one that doesn't love them. Judgment reversed is uh, hoping for forgiveness, wanting forgiveness, but holding on to the dead end, loveless, lack of abundant person because of fear of rejection, fear of not being accepted. This Queen of Pentacles has a golden opportunity for something long-term, for something stable, but she's getting sick of holding on as well. Because the death card is, I'm gonna show it to you how it is. It's like this, okay? So yeah, I mean, she's getting sick of holding on as well. You know, so we got this, somebody is holding on to an empress wannabe, you know, uh, that isn't really an empress. When they have a golden opportunity with somebody that is stable and is solid, both, you know, the holding on is getting old in both situations, okay? So judgment is now reversed, which is a poor judgment call. It's time to move on from that, what, that uh, poor decision. There's consequences for delays. There's consequences for uh, not ending it. The Queen of Pentacles, she's the Queen of Value, right? She knows her value. She knows her worth. Um, she has a lot to offer. <clears throat> there is happiness in the future. You know, a happy relationship. This Queen of Pentacles may be unaware because they, it's like this. Okay. It goes like this. We get the Queen of Pentacles, the Ten of Cups, then the Judgment is right underneath. So the Judgment reversed underneath is lack of awareness. So this Queen of Pentacles may be unaware. She may be unaware that happiness, a happy home, a comfortable relationship is right around the corner. So somebody may be unaware that there's a happy relationship right around the corner. She is the queen of value. The queen of pentacles is the queen of value. She may be unaware of it though because of that judgment card. Reverse lack of awareness. 
you know, judgment card reversed is like lack of forgiveness as well. <laughs> Now, it's interesting because we have the two tens, completion, 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 and then the death card. We have something about an ending here. We An ending is needed. Somebody needs to make a judgment call. They're delaying. They're, they're procrastinating. They're thinking about an opportunity for love. They're not making their decisions. They're thinking about it. They're holding on to a dead-end situation with an individual that doesn't take care of them. That sucks. Knight of Swords in the upright. So that is uh, doing it. Just, I must do this. I must. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. We talk about this sometimes. I gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Got to go. Um, Knight of Swords. Hasty. Making an approach. Sudden arrival. Or sudden departure. This Knight of Swords is somebody that... Looks like a decision. Is This is a decision. This is somebody that is coming in very, very fast. This is rushing in, charging in. Gotta do it right now. Somebody is coming in. This is like a knight in shining armor, right? It is. Unaware that somebody is coming in. They are coming in and they are coming in fast. Get out of the way. Shit or get off the pot. Uh, Knight of Swords. That's get out, get out of the way. I'm coming in. That's get out of the way. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius could be kneeling with. Doesn't have to be. This is somebody that knows what they want, and should anybody get in their way, they're gonna get hurt. Stomped on. I couldn't control it on that one. Ace of Wands. That is exciting. This is a new match. This is a spark. This is a sudden desire. This is exciting. This is a new sexual partner. This is uh, on fire. Okay. This is this person is very very passionate. The passionate entrance here with the Knight of Swords right next to that. This person has this desire to get. Uh, what they want and there ain't no stopping them this is a new start this is very 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 exciting this is somebody that is taking a stand of some sort they're they're getting they're going they're going somewhere they're going towards something that will grow something that they are excited about something very passionate this is just going for it definitely just going for it um This is the decision being made, too. This is the decision that is being made. Somebody is making a decision to go. They're going now. There ain't no stopping this person. They're coming. They're, they're coming in. They're, they're coming in, and they're coming in fast. Very, very passionate. This person is intelligent. Uh, very, very sharp. There could be some uh, sudden communication that is coming. This is a very, it's very sudden. It could be a sudden arrival. Okay, this happens very, very suddenly. There could also be a sudden departure. Okay, because we're reading from thousands of people. We could have somebody here that is departing. Well, that's probably what it is because there's a departure. There is because there's a third party situation here. There's somebody that is leaving a dead end situation where there hasn't been any nurturing. There hasn't been any love. There hasn't been any tender love and care. Put it that way. And they are moving on from a bad choice, and they're taking they're taking a risk. They are taking a risk. They're it's like, and I I do believe that they're they're they are uh, going to be going into something more comfortable, more loving, more happy. I mean, this is happily ever after right here. That's right around the corner. That is a comfortable, happy home. That is beautiful. It's warm. It's 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 just peaceful. Okay. So we, that's right around the corner. It's right around the corner. Happy relationship right around the corner. There, it feels like um, we have somebody that has been procrastinating because of fear of not being accepted. 
but they got this desire to just go and they're gonna go they are gonna go they're ready it feels like they're ready to be judged the decision is being made they've been held back by fear 100 percent all the way this is uh dropping the fear and going going somewhere wherever they're going there's a lot of happiness i feel like there could be i know i keep saying this something about a reunion um i hate to keep saying it too anyhow ten of cups that is a happy 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 togetherness where there's a lot of passion a lot this person is smart. This is somebody that is smart that is coming in. This guy's like, get out of my way because it's uh, that is mine. Good luck. <laughs> 